Hi Leo, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do a reading for the month of September. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Keep in mind, this is for September. We get a lot of people that don't get that. They really do not. And that's why I have to state it over and over and over again. This is for September. It's being recorded in the middle of August. It may resonate now, but in all reality, it's a preview for September. So what do we have for Leo? What do we got for Leo for September? The first thing I saw was a chariot. I don't know if you're dealing with a cancer. You could be. But whatever this is, this is you in the driver's seat dealing with opposition, heading in the right direction, heading towards victory. This is replacing fear with faith. It's you taking back the reins. It's finding discipline. It's taking back control. It's a transformation. It's a card of transformation. But I feel as though you guys have been doing a lot of uh, contemplating, overanalyzing, because I see the Four of Cups right after that. I think that you, you probably have an opportunity that you may not be seeing. You may not be seeing. You may be missing an opportunity. You know, maybe you're heading, maybe you have been heading in the wrong direction. And now you're finally heading in the, in the right direction. But you need to look up. You need, or you need to look in a different direction. It's like you're missing something with the Four of Cups. You're missing something. Okay? Um... There could be some sort of obsession because now I see the four of pentacles. So I'm not sure if you're obsessed. There could be some feeling of, well, obviously there's a feeling because I'm feeling it. Obsession. You may be obsessed with something that isn't good for you. Resisting change. Maybe you're looking for justice, you know, because now I see the justice card. Maybe you're looking for some sort of decision. You're waiting for some sort of decision to be made. Maybe you're dealing with some legal issues. I'm not sure. But justice is also a card of karma. So I feel like you you are being weighed down by some sort of decision because that's what justice is. Perhaps you need to bring balance back. Maybe you need to make a decision. Maybe you need to make a decision to be your own boss. To go in a different direction, to replace fear with faith, to find your mental strength. I do feel like you guys have an unexpected choice in love because now I see the lover's card. Now the lover's card is an unexpected choice in love, but if you look at, if you think about the lover's card, any, most any deck, not all, there's an angel up at the top or Cupid bringing two people together, but there's one person that is looking up and saying, this isn't who I thought it was. Ding, 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 ding. It's not who you think it is. So I feel as though you guys have an unexpected opportunity that you are missing because with that four of cups, because you're, you may be obsessed with somebody that you are not meant to be with. I'm just being honest with you. There could be a feeling of desperation here. I, that's what I'm feeling. Desperate, desperate, desperate. No offense. No offense at all. Desperate to find somebody. Not realizing that there is somebody that you can't see. This person is unusual. They're you're not your usual type. That's another meaning of the lover's card. This person doesn't fit the usual, you know, makeup. They may be odd to you. Or they may not look like what you want them to look like. You know, either way, this person is kind of odd to you. You know what I mean? So there's somebody that you are missing because they seem like they're too odd for you. But it could be meant to be because it could be a soulmate that you're missing because of your, I don't know, perceptions. I feel like something good is coming because I see the Wheel of Fortune. Something good, good, really good is coming. And a Wheel of Fortune is a card of destiny and so isn't the lovers. But you have to stop repeating the same cycles over and over and over again. If you are obsessed with the wrong one, you got to let go of that obsession. And you got to let the angel or Cupid bring you the one that you are meant to be with. Because the Wheel of Fortune is meant to be and the Lovers is meant to be. But it's not who you think it is. Happiness is coming. Maybe it's coming this month. Maybe you're going to be blessed because now I see the Ten of Cups. So you have an opportunity for extreme happiness here. If you can really open your eyes to a new perspective. I 
What do we got for Leo, dear God, angel, spirits, and universe for the month of September? September. It's time for closure because now I just see the 999. It's time to move on from something that you have been obsessed with. And if you're desperate, that's an obsession. Desperate to find somebody. Let go and let God. Let them bring you in what is meant to be. You don't have to chase it. Let it come to you. It will come to you like the chariot It comes to you. or It will arrive. It will arrive. But if you're chasing it, I mean, you got no, 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 no. I f now I see the nine of swords, despair, anguish, sadness, loneliness. Don't let your loneliness cause you to be desperate and call in somebody or allow somebody to come into your life that is going to mistreat you because you're desperate. You have an offer of love coming in. I know that you do because I see the Knight of Cups. So an offer of love is coming in. But I also Knight of Cups can also be wanting a relationship, wanting romance. But the Knight of Cups is also somebody that sweeps you off your feet and they really don't have anything to offer you, perhaps. Be careful. Be really, really, really careful. You may have a Cancer that is coming into your life. Um, I think I already said that. Um... You do have a major new beginning coming up. Ooh, hangman reversed. This is new perspective. That is the meaning of the hangman reversed. New perspective. So you get it. You you take on a new perspective. Look at things differently. Look at people differently, and you will get unstuck. From this state of suspension that you have been in. I feel like some of you have been in a state of suspension. You've been in a state of limbo. You've been waiting and waiting. And I think the waiting is over if you let go and let God. Let go and let God. You don't need to chase it. You really don't need to chase it. And that is a message that you need to hear. Um, if you have to chase, it's not meant to be. So what do we got for Leo for September? You got universal guidance because now I see 444. So it's like you're being protected. That is universal protection. 444. Nine of Swords. Oh my goodness. Did we talk about this? I think we already did, didn't we? I see I talked so fast I can't remember what I said. This is despair. Sadness. All, all tied up. You notice that he's all tied up. of swords a moment of decision you need and it's like very prote protective we have this shield you see both of these people are very very protected battling struggling don't want to be alone right i just don't want to be alone i have to tell you the nine of pentacles reverse there ain't nobody that completes you once you realize that once you are single and you love it and you're living your life every day free and happy and you're not chasing, it will come. We have somebody here that is very lonely and doesn't want to be alone. No grace, very insecure, a need for discipline. <laughs> you complete you. Nobody else does and you need to realize that. Seven of Cups reversed. Make a decision <laughs> and stick to it. Three of Cups reversed. The Magician reversed. Nine of Wands. It says Rods, but it's Wands. I think that you guys are facing some life challenges. And I think you're trying to find all the strength that you can muster to do so. I feel like some of you have been in maybe a state of dis disillusionment, you know. And, it, and you, need to be, you need to get real here. You need to be practical. Um... This is a loss. The challenge is is loss of a relationship, loss of friends. Um, three of this is in your challenge position. This is a three of cups reversed. This is blocked. 
you may be blocked by a friend or blocked, blocked, a re you may have even blocked a relationship, whether it's with a friend or whatever it is. You may have blocked some sort of relationship. This is deception. This is trickery. This is a trickster. This is, uh, this is a no. Okay. The magician reversed is a no. No, I'm not happy alone. No, I don't want to be alone. Oh my God. And nobody does want to be alone, right? Hmm. Deception. There's some sort of deception here. And you may be deceiving yourself. You know, you got to be careful here. And now we got these two nines. Remember I said nine? I wonder if we're going to get another one. I said nine, nine, nine. Um, Wheel of Fortune. Change. I saw the Wheel of Fortune. Change. Ch something is about to change. Changing your direction. Closing out a cycle. Ah, there's your other nine. Nine, nine, nine. And I knew it. I did know it. Um, and there's your chariot. Interesting. Interesting. So something is going to arrive. But this is in your approach position, the chariot. So what you need to do, what you need to do, Leo, is master your emotions. Take control. Be disciplined. Be very, 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 very disciplined. Right now, you're going through some sort of transformation. This transformation has to do with your perception. Okay, it does. I think that it's time for you to change directions. This is changing directions, and this is changing directions. It's, you, need to, you need to stop doing what you have been doing. I don't know what it is, but you do. You do. Yeah, I think that you're losing friends. You may be losing relationships. Maybe, maybe there's a feeling of desperado. Desperado. You know, that's what I... It's like... Take a time out. Take a time out to focus on yourself. Maybe you need to go through some sort of spiritual awakening. Maybe you need to block or not get engaged in a relationship right now. It's time for you to heal. It's time for you to work on yourself. But that Knight of Cups, that's wanting a relationship, right? You just want a relationship. But you have to be healed first. You have to be ready for it. And the Nine of Pentacles reversed? Not ready. I'm telling you what. And I know that you guys don't want to hear this. Because you only want to hear the positive. Leos want to hear the positive. Think about the sun card. Please, I only want to hear the positive. That's not reality. You need to put a, you need to put a barrier up. You need to take a time out. You need to go within. You need to go through, you need to reevaluate where you're going, what your standards are, what kind of people that you want, what kind of relationships that you want in your life. You know, you, you need to really decide what the hell you want. You need to become the master of yourself, master of yourself. And you, and, and that's going to take time that, that it, it is going to take time. Maybe even nine months. And if you think nine months is too long to work on yourself, that is sad. Oh, here's another nine. Nine, 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 nine. What? What? It's time for you to close out a cycle in your life. It's time for you to go in a new direction and that doesn't mean that you you speed and that's one of the things that you do you want to hurry you want to, you want to speed i can see that i can see that speeding will cause an accident i feel like this is a month where you need to focus on yourself it's not time for a relationship. I see that you want one. It's almost like you're desperate for one. You're desperate for somebody to love you. You will have somebody that loves you. But you must 
love yourself first. And that is what I got, Leo. So September is a timeout to re figure out who you are, to go through your own transformation. This is meant to be. You are going to change your direction for the better. Whatever is happening is bringing you closer to your life's purpose. This is angel protection and 444 is angel protection. You are being protected, but you have to find your inner strength to master your emotions, take a time out, go within, replan, rediscover yourself. Don't let your desperation get you into a karmic relationship that is going to hurt you. You should be enjoying your singlehood. There could be a loss of money or a loss of abundance because you are so focused on finding somebody. It costs money to go out and party. I feel as though you need to make a better choice. You've probably been out drinking. You've probably been out partying. You've been out making bad choices with the Seven of Cups. <laughs> and you need to refocus. You need to reevaluate. It's time for a change. It's time to figure out who, what, where, who you are. Right now... I definitely see partying, drinking, you know, going overboard. And it, it, it may be causing you, it may be causing you, you know, to have hangovers or stress or whatever the case is. It affects your mood. It's almost like you're losing, it's almost like you're losing respect for yourself. Take a time out. Go within. Reevaluate. Let go and let God. Make a wiser decision. Put a barrier up. Put a guard up. Go within. Solitude. September is a month of solitude. That's what I got. Good luck.